Yo, what's up guys? My name is Justin. Welcome back to Justin Gamble Gamble. We are here in Chantilly, Virginia for the Chantilly Card Show. Guys, we're making a bunch of content this week. I hope you guys enjoy them. If you like the content, I know I sound like a broken record, but legit, just tap that like button. Tap it. Bink. Done. Tap. Type a little comment saying like just like a smiley face or something. It doesn't have to be that crazy, but it helps the channel. We're uploading the next day with our content. It's so fun making these videos. It doesn't cost anything for you guys to watch them. So just bink that like button. Drop a little comment. Subscribe if you're not. Cue the vlog. I've been getting dirty money, Jordan Belfort. Last night we got to work at the trade night. That's the reason why I'm not in like the fastest rush to get to the show right now. But let me just show you these pickups real quick. All from trade night in the hotel lobby. Card number one, Aaron Rodgers. Field level select, black, one of one. This card is filthy. I love cards like this. If you have one of ones like that, please send them to me on Instagram. Had to pick this up. Caitlin Clark on card auto, numbered to 50. Such a sick card. Jordan Love, Donruss Optic, negative PSA 10. It's a cheap card, it's like 90 bucks. And then this is dope, a Marshawn Lynch auto, rookie auto. And our final card is a Joe Montana Panini one, on card auto, BGS. 9.5, this card is way too cheap. Hall of Fame on card auto, 9.5, it's only like six, 700 bucks. And I thought this was another card I picked up at trade night, but it's not, but I love these. If you have downtowns, kabooms, or any of those, please also hit me up. Last night was fantastic, we have a little head start on the day, but let's go to the show now. So when I said I was retiring the Zion until we get the sponsorship, I'm not exaggerating. We are now using a suitcase. I have two camera bags in there, foam padded camera bags inside of put all my slabs in. Zion, if you want me to start bringing back the roller, we're gonna need a little more than just the promo code. <laughs> oh my God, it is packed in here today. Let's go. Let's go make some deals. Getting straight to work. Gold XRC PSA 10 of Clyde Edwards Alaire. Pretty fire. Pick this up for 150. Thank you. Easy Appreciate up. it. And also picked up this Olave RPA number to 25 for 110. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Yep. Just got two deals on quick. Bang. Wow. Just did like a very unexpected trade. Traded off this Brees Hall 101 Nike swoosh for three cards. Sauce Gardner cracked. Gold vinyl Garrett Wilson, Anthony Richardson, and $150. Thank you, bro. Yes, sir. Let's that trade is sick. Let me know who you think won that one. Happy birthday, dear Tyler. Yeah, Happy birthday to you. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. Hey. hey. Enjoy it. 30. Turning 30 at a card Turning show is crazy. I'm telling you, it's going to bring great luck. Yeah, bring <laughs> great luck. We'll see. You got to get paid strong because it's your birthday today. Yeah, <laughs> it's crazy. That's, that's in the ideal world, but it don't work like that. So I want the Jim Brown. Eating cake at a show, a birthday cake is crazy. Best I can do is 60%. On your birthday? That's fucked. <laughs> Trying to get a deal done here. So, I don't know anything about vintage. Zero. But I know if you have a Jim Brown rookie, it's like disgustingly big. Like a six figure big card. Yeah, they're big. There's two comps PSA 7, 420, 480. I think it's worth like 450. Yeah, plus or minus. Yeah, I could value it at 450 for you. Oh, what's the price? What's the birthday price? What's the birthday price? The birthday price. That's what we're doing now. The birthday price. Okay. The birthday present in itself is buying the brick. Is Jim Brown a brick? He's not a brick, but like apparently at the at the show it is. At the show, apparently no one wants it. Very weird. This was my number that I would offer normally. Oh boy. Right? But it's the birthday price, so 380. 380. I would sell it for four. What the fuck? I thought I was doing a good thing. For four, he says. Hold on. 390. 390 is fine. Thank you. Yeah, you got it, bro. That's a strong grip. Damn. You have to do like the Donald Trump thing where he's always like grabs you in. <laughs> Sick. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do with this card, but. This is pretty dope. I'm not mad about it at all. Thank you, Tyler. Happy birthday. Jada, that's such a good wardrobe choice today. Oh yeah, of course. You know, gotta represent, gotta represent. I appreciate that. Oh, look who it is. <laughs> this fucker is here, huh? Did you really just have to tote it real quick? Wow. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, Jim Brown. Like, I have actually no fucking idea. Hey, do you guys like, uh, like vintage? Yeah. yeah I do, do you? Actually. You do? Oh yeah, shit, do. maybe I do have a guy. You see my roof, right? I showed you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's actually, that's actually. Yeah. 
That's actually fire. Centering is good on it. Vin that matters for vintage. Yeah, yeah. Yo, vintage car could be like four hundred dollars, and you could say it's centered. I want eight, and yeah. they'll buy it. I know. Like, That's how I'm gonna do. Four twenty four eighty on this. You want it? Quick flip. I just bought it two seconds ago. For a Fleer? Yeah. What else you got in there? I know you got some good stuff. That's it. That's all I got. What's Contour? Yo, four twenty four eighty. Holy crap! Yo, four hundred four eighty coin flip. Duh, let's do it. Flip it. Let's go. That was quick. Bang! I thought I was gonna sell this Point shit. Flip. Here we go. I always go heads. I always go tails. So I would accept. Oh, right. dude! Right. <laughs> Here we go. Bang! Oh, man. Appreciate 400. it. <laughs> Ten dollar profit. That pays for the beer. We're good. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you, sir. We're of on course. The mountains. We're on the mountains. Yep, 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 yep. It's really never too early. Cheers. The show has technically ended for the day, but we're doing a last minute deal. We have a Mahomes downtown and a Brian Robinson Jr. one of one rookie auto. It is, the offer is 635. Wow, that was quick. Easy, let's go. All right. Do you guys know the story behind why there's ketchup on this card? It's like so bizarre to me. I didn't know this till recently. Apparently, Mahomes loves ketchup and puts ketchup on everything. Puts ketchup on like waffles. That's disgusting. That's the most disgusting thing I've ever heard. Well, I guess now that I'm thinking about it, Mahomes really is like a winning machine. So maybe I start, I should start putting some fucking ketchup on everything. Maybe that changes up my luck with cards. Maybe I put a ketchup on slabs. You know how, <laughs> you know how like all the cleaners, like Kurt's Card Care and shit, they're putting like wax and all that stuff on cards. Maybe I'll just lather some fucking ketchup on it. <laughs> That's how you get tens. The amount of SGC tens I've had that I've cracked out, sent to PSA and gotten PSA eights back is vile. I don't know if I'm just a hater or if I'm just really unlucky, but buying SGC 10s at a premium just doesn't do it for me based off personal experience. Cause how are you gonna tell me it's a 10, but every single time I've cracked it out, it comes back not, the values don't add up. Comment below what you think, am I just a hater? Or is SGC 10s just bullshit? I think the reason why they give so many 10s out is because they want people to use their service. So they can be like, oh, it's a 10. It's not a fucking 10, it's ass. To be honest, I did not know the show was ending at 5 p.m. today. Uh, <laughs> I thought the show ended at 8, but it is what it is. I just want to speed run real quick through what we have. Look at this. Pan the camera. There is. There's no one in here anymore. I'm fiending to make deals. Everyone's like, oh, there's a trade night at the hotel. It's at 9 p.m. I'm like, bro, it's fucking 5. What am I supposed to do? But let's just speed run through some of my favorite deals that I still have. Like, I had that Brock Purdy, Black Pandora. That's probably the best pickup I had of the weekend, but it's gone. But let's just start it off strong. Boom. Donald Trump downtown. Tell me this isn't the sharpest buy in the hobby. This is fucking crazy. A make America great again fucking downtown while we're in, while we're 30 minutes away from the capital. Sharp. Brian Robinson Jr., Phoenix one of one, rookie auto. Joe Burrow, PSA 10 mosaic, rookie auto. LeBron James, gold fireworks, BGS 95, number to 10. This is a nuke. Marshawn Lynch, oh, I already showed you this. Sauce Gardner, cracked ice, rookie auto. Garrett Wilson, gold minor. Patrick Mahomes, we just picked this up. I think I showed this already, but I'll show it again. Can't this show it some love. Luca, rookie auto, BGS95, gold, but it's not number to 10, it's a number to 25, weird, but picked it up. And uh, yeah, this one earlier today. Clyde Edwards, pretty solid day. Not too bad, but I don't know what to do now. Should we go like hang around in the Walmart, go run around and play basketball in the fucking sports section? Like, what are we doing? Now? I don't know. What are you doing, Chantilly? Virginia, I don't know. Are we fucked? I don't know. It turns out that we were fucked. There was nothing to do. And now I'm currently at the airport editing this video. I am at the airport five hours early before my flight so I can get this video up in time. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you guys have friends like sports cards, I lost my voice. I'll see you guys tomorrow with the new ball. Peace.